Here we go, guys. Hi. Hey. Yes. <laughs> Welcome to a new vlog. I actually don't know what today's vlog is going to be about, but I, <laughs> I'm just with <laughs> Caleb and Flo. Yes, and am, there's yeah. Caleb, there's Flo. <laughs> and I was like, you know what, guys? We're going to some charity shops. I was like, let's just film it. But then Caleb started having a very interesting conversation about men's fashion mm -hmm. in charity shops. So, Caleb, it's your piece. So, <laughs> I'm excited to see what the, um, the men's section in charity shops are like. I don't know. Mm -hmm. um, whether some of the guys watching, whether you um, try to find ethical fashion, you find there's so much stuff for women, oh. but not that much mm. for men. Um, so we'll see what we find. Um, yeah, I think for me it's not about consumption, but about finding something you actually really need mm. uh, when I'm shopping. So yeah, what were you at the moment, for? at the moment, I'm looking for a very nice zip-up hoodie. Yeah. So what are you looking for? Anything that you're looking for? I, I am looking out for some black jeans. Oh, okay, so the challenge is a zip up, black jeans, and I quite like a new jumper. I don't really <laughs> know. But we all met at Emerging Influencers, so... Woo! Well, this is a bit embarrassing now, guys. <laughs> Filming in public, ooh. But... We love Emerging Influencers. But we'll tell you more about it later. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to go because this is a bit embarrassing now. Bye. Bye! Okay, guys, so the first charity shop of the day. All dogs matter because we're inclusive in this filming yeah. and we love dogs so Justice much. For dogs. So, should we have a look? Should we do a funky hat? Are you going to say something? Caleb goes, this hat needs to be on the floor. And then he doesn't say anything, he just does. Have you found anything? Caleb, will you be taking that home today? Is it in the basket? Price of three pounds. Mm. I think this could probably go to a better home than me. I think so I don't so think it's too. something I need. Mm. I, mean, I'm for the things that I, I think it might be good. wasted, wouldn't it? Yeah. yeah. I think this will make some Lego Batman fan very happy one day. <laughs> but also, look at this vibey mirror. Yeah, if it is cute. Up. What shoes have we got on today, guys? North. There we go. Represent the eco. Vija. Vija. Vija, better. How do you pronounce it? No, because normally I have. Um, okay, I was going to say shoes, but these are really old. I've had them for years. They're my Doing home me. shoes, they don't come to uni with me. They're actually quite unfibery. I like them. Lots well, of people do, like do you know them. what? The laces are like this because when I was like 14, I got some bright green what would Jesus do laces and I put them on and then I just found them too embarrassing and couldn't wear them. What would Jesus <laughs> do? <laughs> <laughs> That's brilliant. I like that. Wait, they've got they gay little legs. What the flip? Mm. Caleb, is this your new love? How much I, is it? It is. I mean, to be fair, it does look kind of bad. The dinosaurs just don't 50. fit. I'm confused. It's like got too many things going on. <laughs> I think I think that's that, that's what's drawn me to this particular garment. <laughs> to this piece. Uh, like, yeah, for, for, for party wear, you know. Come to on, be fair, I'm gonna be, Caleb, you're making you know. it sound like, you know, you go parties. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, our friendship group does love a party. I, I also love a good mix of shirts. I've got, I've got Two or three shirts that I rotate. Thank you so much for this deep party. knowledge. <laughs> my, my personal favourite is one that I found at a music festival that's made out of old, <gasps> old tea towels. It's so cool. It's to be fair, fair that, that, that one I love is now attached. Look at that. You know what? If it was underneath the thing, it kind of would work. Under the dungaree? Yeah. <laughs> nah, you can't do that. Yeah, yeah, I think you could. Yeah. Would you say so? Yeah. I think you should do it. Yes. It's Caleb. better than dinosaurs. Is this one your fave so far? I actually really like it. <laughs> in its own ironic way. You cannot wear that. <laughs> 375. More Look, affordable. Let's try it on now. Here we go. In six months' time, this will be the price of a meal deal. <laughs> oh. oh. With the dungarees as well. I could wear it open. Like. Let's do it. <laughs> I think this thinking, may have guys? to be. A summer purchase. A summer people, cause, purchase. Cause people will look at it and be like, Caleb, nice shirt. And then they'll really look at it and they'll be like, oh my gosh, it's Santa. Santa here? I know him. I mean, I think it's quite vibey. For three, how much? Three? Three seventy-five. Yeah, do it. Yeah. The price is it's it. Meal deal. Yeah, do it. I think this is the shirt I'm looking for. You say yes to the dress. I think I'm going to say yes to the dress. This is the single most important garment I will ever wear. Yeah. Okay, guys, so we finished shopping. I didn't get anything, sadly, but let's hear it. So, 
What did you get? I oh, got what have I done? this <laughs> denim jumpsuit. Mm. Originally from Tesco, I think it's like TU. It is so <laughs> nice. I was like, I don't know if I can put it off, and I tried it on, and then she pulled it off. It work, it like, she pulled okay, it off. It has to happen. It's giving like Abba Mumia. Yes, with some Xena earrings. That's yeah. what I said. Xena earrings and like a funky hairband. <laughs> and Caleb, what did you find? I got the ultimate sun party shirt. <laughs> All the music festivals. Sixty-one this year. <laughs> Luminosity this year. Let's I'll be see wearing it. this. So, you may think it's just a nice, interesting It is nice shirt. from afar. But it is and nice then you look a bit closer. Oh, oh look it's, it's Santa! Santa. <laughs> it says summer like Santa. <laughs> you're going to be like at all these festivals. We're thinking about going yeah. into rolling as well now. Yeah. And you're, you're going to be wearing this in Europe in the middle of summer. I think that's quite <laughs> brilliant. Okay, so, what is your... I can't fit in it, it's fine. What is your guys' top tip from charity shopping after today? Mm. Top tip for shopping. Mm. Mine would be don't just buy something because it's in a charity shop. Oh, yeah, yeah, carry yeah, on, yeah. say more about so, that. Uh, you know, I think there's something to be said for buying something you really, really like. So that shirt, I really, really like. I think I'll wear it a lot today. Uh, but there's lots of other things that I liked a little bit. I was like, it's in a charity shop, I could get it, it's really yeah, cheap. Yeah, yeah. But will you actually wear it? Mm. I think, you know, Find the things that you know you enjoy wearing, and charity shops are a great way to get some really cheap, amazing finds. And actually, I think another thing about charity shops is like to blab on. No, don't and worry. It's like the experience, you know, it's yeah, a great time. It's, yeah, like, it's, it's fun. It's when you, you find, find something, something you're like, yeah, <laughs> there have been some awful things that I'm yeah. going to get this, you guys are left. <laughs> no, don't be doing that. Oh my gosh, there's yeah. quite a few. What about you, Flo? Yeah, like, I really agree. I think, I think it's so easy, like, to feel like it's it's still like shopping and stuff but it's like really sustainable so why does it matter but actually like at the core of it the issue is the overconsumption I think we were saying earlier yeah. like if you just bought one jump from H&M but then like wore it for the rest of your life and really loved it and looked after it that actually really would not be an issue but it's, yeah. it's the overconsumption and like we're still buying into that whole world of overconsumption if we overconsume even if the brands are sustainable or even if it is second hand like and and I, and I think we, we can still have fun with fashion from like that second hand is a great way to like still get things that are on trend without it costing the planet but like yeah not buying into that overconsumption because the more the more we buy into that the more it like becomes culture the more like we're not we're not we're not living out the values that we want to be come on around. I love that wait and also these guys so Flo you've seen before in these vlogs if you've watched them for a long time but these guys are both from the emerging influencers what's my hand doing we're not too sure but these two are both from the emerging influencers and we all met, well I knew Caleb for ages, but we met, me and Flo and Caleb all met from that. What's your favourite part about emerging influencers? Well, what's your favourite part about after being like, post emerging influencers? Yeah, I'm going to get to you guys. Yeah. <laughs> Um, and like we all pray on like a Wednesday morning, uh, which is so like um, out of that like a group of us all did it, and like it just was really great friendships. And also it feels like we went to just love now, but it feels like we're doing magic for us. But now all of us like involved in like just love and other CDs, and it's kind of like was like the next steps or something and it's like mm -hmm. but, we've got yeah. week, but I'm able to know what's happening in all the other just loves because yeah. of the emerging infants because yeah. of this like network that we've created between us yeah. we love it yeah. we love it is, it, it is a massive community and like mm. everyone knows everyone is really supportive and giving each other different tips and challenges yeah. each other and, um, yeah, yeah. yeah especially if you're moving to uni yes. um, oh my God. check out just love because they are amazing like you'll meet These so two many are both great people co-presidents co co yes. you come into Manchester I'll buy you a coffee Oh, <laughs> you got it, guys. I'm I need, I need to offer it for Darren now, yeah? yeah. I'll get you, I'll get you a coffee. With open, with open. <laughs> but these guys are awesome, and so check out if you are in Durham or if you're in Manchester, and if you're in Newcastle, you come to one that I'd go to. But um, what was I going to say? Oh yeah. Anyway, you have a really cool Instagram for photos. Like, you can check out. Feel film photos. Oh, I'm jumping that. I haven't posted okay. on it in ages. Oh, well, if you're into film photography, follow the Bedroom Wall Collection. It's great. <laughs> there we go. Uh, yeah, follow those gems. I haven't posted on that recently either, but we can I can get tell. I will. So, yeah. yeah, I love their Instagram system, so it makes me so happy. But I'm gonna leave, finish this because this is very long. But mwah. hope you have a lovely week. Thank you guys for joining me. I'll see you later.